The official name of the restaurant is the Dudley Chateau. But everybody calls it the Chat. It's mom and pop, and it's truly authentic. The building is over 90 years old, and it is filled with history. At one time, it was a speakeasy. Ted Williams used to hang out here. Babe Ruth used to hang out here. And now I hang out here. So maybe they've taken a slight dip in prestige. <laughs> You can't buy an authentic atmosphere like this. Just walking up the staircase is quite a journey. It's a little wobbly. The floors are a little uneven. Once you get upstairs, oh, it's like you've ended up in pub grub nirvana. There is stuff and tchotchkes all over the walls. There have been some patrons that felt the need to add items, and there's some that subtract those items. What you see is what you get. It's sensory overload. The signs in the ceiling, the license plates, all the sports memories all the nautical stuff. The bar is built out of a boat. It's almost too much to comprehend. And every time I come in here, there's some new crap up on the walls. The first thing I order any time I come in here are their wings. They are big, they are fried. I love the buffalo. I also recommend the buffacue wings. That's a combination of buffalo and barbecue. Super mouth water. You're really gonna love it. A lot of restaurants serve steak and cheese egg rolls these days, but I'm telling you, the Shat is the master. Golden fried, shaved steak, peppers, onions, cheese. You can order these two hours later. Somehow, they are still piping hot. I think they must be filled with steak, cheese, and molten lava, but they go really well with some horseradish dip. I describe them as heaven in a roll. I'm gonna recommend the Mexican grilled cheese, tomato, jalapeno peppers, chipotle mayo, and a little bit of a nacho chip crunch. That's deliciousness, comfort food style, and it's really, really good. Steak tips are hugely popular here. They're straight off the grill, they're marinated so they are tender, served with some peppers and some onions over some rice pilaf. It's a big portion of steak tips. You're not gonna walk away hungry, and everything here is super affordable. So get the tips, don't spend much money, you'll be a happy person. This thing is big and bold and absolutely beautiful. I like to get it breakfast style. They call it the rise and shine. That comes with some sauteed shaved sirloin steak, American cheese, plus bacon, egg, and a little bit of mayo. It's not really the healthiest breakfast in the world, but it goes well with a nice shot of whiskey. They are serious about burgers here at the Shack. The burgers are outstanding. People just absolutely rave over them. These are gigantic 10 ounce fresh ground Angus beef burgers served hot off the open flame grill. I think the top burger to get is the cheesy bacon stuffed burger. That's a mouthful, but if you gotta squish it down a little bit to get all that deliciousness in, it's worth the squish. One of the most popular burgers is the Cowboy, topped with some honey barbecue sauce and some melted cheese and a beautifully crisp and golden Vidalia onion ring. You got sweetness, smokiness, beefiness, awesomeness. That's a good burger fit for a cowboy. If you come here, you are going to swear that you're lost, even if you follow your GPS. I brought my friends here, and she thought I was punking her. You're gonna end up driving through this residential neighborhood in the middle of nowhere in Wayland by a pond, and you're gonna say, I must be at the wrong place. Trust your GPS. This is it, this is the place. I know it doesn't look like much from the outside or from the inside, but it's still amazing. People come here, let their hair down, enjoy themselves, enjoy the food, meet people that they haven't seen in a long time or make new friends. The jukebox is going and the drinks are flowing and the food is delicious. It's a good vibe, kind of like being in someone's living room. So at the end of the day, here's what you need to know about the chat. It's hard to find, but it is easy to fall in love with. And once you're here once, you're part of the family. So cheers to the Dudley Chateau, AKA the Shat. Let's get Shat-faced.